Texas transportation officials told us tonight they're at the beginning of a very long process to improve traffic on Interstate 35. This evening, TxDOT held this open house in Northeast Austin to get feedback on their new plan. Officials want to add toll lanes in each direction on I-35 from Riverside Drive up to 183. Part of that project includes whitening the lower deck of the interstate and adding a longer entrance and exit ramp on the upper deck. One longtime business owner we spoke with tonight is worried about what could happen to the frontage roads on I-35 once construction begins. No, Sky's Auto Sales. We have at least two a car lot right now. And that, that was my concern because if this deal goes through, a car lot's not going to work if there's no access off the frontage road anymore. But the initial plans keep the frontage roads intact. TxDOT says it wants to get more feedback on this project to see if something can be done better. Construction not expected to begin until 2020 at the earliest. The projected finish date is in 2025. Well, this map gives you some perspective on the scope of Central 7 project. It covers the area between 183 to the north and Riverside Drive down to the south. But it's just one of a part of a series of improvements planned along more than 30 miles of I-35 in the Austin area. TxDOT is also working on the South 10 plan, which stretches from Riverside Drive down south to FM 1327 near the Hayes County line. Work will include extended entrance and exit lanes and wider frontage roads. Similar improvements are part of the North 16 plan, which runs from 183 north to FM 1431. The North 16 plan calls for reconfiguring several on and off ramps to improve safety and traffic flow. And remember, the whole project, north, central, and south, calls for adding tolled express lanes. Those are different than regular toll lanes.